like, well, like, thank Welcome. you. Welcome. <laughs> to your apartment? <laughs> to, to your apartment. It's really great to have you here. Um, I love what you've done with the place. I love what I've done with the place. <laughs> yeah. You may not see much progress in a month, and that's kind of disheartening because you feel like you've changed your life so dramatically, but it takes a lot of time, and that's really hard, and it requires a lot of patience. It requires a lot of repetitive motion. And with an instrument, it's the same thing. And I think for me, I learned that, I mean, I've been playing the violin for about 20 years now. And, you know, I do the same scales and repetitive, basically stretching and exercises every day for about 45 minutes that I've been doing for about 10 years now. I mean, this violin was made in 1729. It's like 300 years old. That's crazy. Right? first gym I ever joined. I lived a few blocks away and I googled gym on my phone and I was this <laughs> tiny violinist and I was had no idea what I was walking into. It was in January 2020 and then two months later the lockdown first hit so my membership didn't last too long. Vera started doing the online classes when we were doing uh, the Instagram you know, workouts and everything. I basically had no shows and things were kind of <clears throat> indefinite for me of when they were going to come back. And so, you know, talked to Noah and I picked up a barbell basically for the first time and said, I want to make a change. I want to make a difference. I, you know, here it is a year later, essentially. Um, and it's been a complete change. I've learned all these different skills and I've never heard or seen another institution where, you know, you can walk into the gym and it doesn't matter if it's someone who teaches Pilates, if it's someone who teaches yoga, someone who specializes in Olympic lifting, or it, it doesn't matter. I mean, everyone has all these different skills and I can approach anyone with a comment, hey, can you watch my form? Hey, I'm having this pain in my shoulder. Like, do you have a stretch for this? I think it really feels validating to see a physical change in your appearance. But I think what's even more important is a way to funnel your um, ambition and the way that you're able to funnel and channel uh, commitment to something. You pay attention and use slow building blocks. The better it's gonna become, the stronger you're gonna get, and the happier you're gonna be with not only your appearance, but your um, self-affirmation of that you've learned a new skill and that you're getting better.